Hello student, in this video, I will demonstrate that how can you find x-intercept of a quadratic equation. To explain that how can we find the quadratic equation, I am taking an example. Let us take y equals x square plus 6x plus 5. To get x intercept we always put a y equals 0 so put y equals 0 so put here 0 in place of y and now solve for the value of x to solve it for the value of x first i will flip lhs and rhs so i will write RHS first so it is x square plus 6x plus 5 gives me 0 now I can factorize it using various methods I am using a simple identical method to find the factors of this given equation here coefficient of x is 6 and constant term is 5 so we need two numbers whose product is 5 and sum is 6. We know that 1 times of 5 gives me 5 and 1 plus 5 gives me 6. So that I can write this middle term as 1 plus 5 and this term constant term as 1 times of 5. Now I can use the identity use identity that x square plus a plus b x plus a times of b gives me x plus a x plus b so using this identity i can write that factor of this given equation will x plus what is the value of a you can see here the value of a is 1 and value of b is 5 so i can replace this a and b by 1 and 5 and i will get x plus 1 and x plus 5 equals 0 so i have solved this expression using this identity and I get this value here x is equal to 1 oh sorry a is equal to 1 and b is equal to 5 now we can solve it further to get the value of x which is x intercept so we know that product of two numbers can zero only when one of them is zero so either x plus 1 equals 0 or x plus 5 equals 0 solve it further I will get send this one to right hand side it will change to minus 1 or this is or x is equal to send this plus 5 into RHS right hand side it becomes minus 5 so our numbers are x equals minus 1 and x equals minus 5. So our x intercept are x equals minus 1 comma and we plug the value of y equals 0. So value of y will always 0 and second intercept can minus 5 comma value of y is 0 there. So there are two intercept minus 1 comma 0 and minus 5 comma 0. If you learn this proportion properly with the help of this video, please subscribe our channel and don't forget to like our video. Thank you for watching this video. Take care. Bye.